Traditionally, airlines tend to stick with one major aircraft manufacturer for the majority of their narrow-body fleets, often either Boeing or Airbus. But in recent years, a number of airlines that once flew only Airbus A320 family jets have made the surprising decision to add Boeing 737s into their fleets. Today, we're exploring which airlines have made this move and why. Like, subscribe, and share. The sponsor of today's video is Intuitive.me, boosting your personal and your business development. For personal development, stress management, reduction, and prevention, overcoming obstacles, breaking through blockages, and trauma healing. This while utilizing tools like channeling, intuition, the gene keys, grounding, and meditation. And for businesses, the efficiency improvement, stress management, reduction, and prevention, relationship management, and networking training. Find out more by clicking the link in the description. Now back to the video. First up, Valeris. The Mexican low-cost carrier has historically been an Airbus-only airline operating over 115 Airbus A320 family aircraft. However, in recent years, Valeris experimented with adding Boeing 737s into its fleet. These aircraft were mainly leased for specific operations, making Valeris one of the few Airbus-dominant airlines to briefly incorporate the 737s into its operations. While their focus remains on Airbus, the move to a mixed fleet shows the airline's flexibility in managing fleet demands and operational costs. Next, we take a look at Frontier Airlines. While today, Frontier operates an all-Airbus fleet with over 120 A320neo family aircraft, their early days were a bit different. In the early 2000s, Frontier flew both Airbus A320 family jets and Boeing 737s. This was a short-lived experiment, and Frontier eventually decided to go all-in on Airbus, but it shows that even some of today's most loyal Airbus customers have dabbled with Boeing jets in the past. Over in Southeast Asia, we have AirAsia X. Known for its massive Airbus A320 fleet across its subsidiaries, AirAsia X also explored the idea of adding Boeing 737s to its operations, particularly through its affiliate AirAsia X Indonesia. Although it hasn't fully committed to a mixed fleet, this consideration reflects the strategic flexibility of even the most Airbus-dominant airlines in expanding and exploring Boeing options. So why are these traditionally Airbus-only airlines considering Boeing 737? For some, it's about leasing availability. For others, the Boeing 737 Max's efficiency and operational range make it an appealing choice, especially when combined with the competitive pricing Boeing offers to lure Airbus customers. In many cases, airlines need to meet rapid fleet expansion demands, and Boeing can help fill those gaps. But in most of these cases, the airlines maintain their Airbus-heavy fleets while strategically adding a few 737s. While Airbus continues to dominate the fleets of many carriers, Boeing 737 still holds appeal for some operators. From Valeris to Frontier, we've seen airlines adjust their strategies and in some cases, return to their Airbus routes after brief Boeing experiments. As fuel efficiency and fleet flexibility become even more critical, it will be fascinating to see which direction these airlines take in the future. So, what do you think? Will more Airbus-only airlines start adding Boeing jets to their fleets? Let us know in the comments below, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more aviation insights.